What's good? It's not even my intro. What's good, YouTube? It's your boys, Eric. Shy. Back it again with another reaction video. Poverty Gang. Yeah. Stand up. We got a link to the merch in the description box below. We got 50 Cent in the club. The international version. I didn't even know there was an international version. I only knew the BT version. Then I think they tried to maybe put on BT Uncut. But wasn't nothing on that. You know why we came there. For that Nelly tip drill. And uh, booty, booty popping. No, no, pussy, pussy popping on a handstand. Ludicrous is Jane. Oh, there. Only got two minutes. I can get it. <laughs> I was discussing this again. But yeah, man, I, I did a jar rule, and you're going to see that also. I was like, screw it. I might as well do 50 Cent also, and then I should have a Wu Tang clamming up. Hopefully, if I'm not too tired, which I am exhausted right now. So let's get into this. This honestly was the second song I heard of 50. The main one was, You say you're a wankster, but you never pun none. Like, Wankster was the first song I heard, and I knew instantly. I was like, Yo, I have to download like all this stuff. I was in line work with it. What is this? Somewhere at, uh, was it is Shady Aftermath? Ah, see, I knew it. I remember. That nigga start off doing crunches. He fall down doing crunches. Mm. 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 She could still get the dick. Eminem look young as hell, but I'm pretty sure around this time he was close to 30 something. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 shawty. It's your birthday. We gon' party like, like it's, it's your birthday. We gon' sip a coffee like it's your birthday. And you know we don't give up. It's not your birthday. Find me in the club. Bottle full of bub. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I mean, I'm in the habit of sex. I ain't in the making love. So come give me a. Here's a sneak nod also that some of y'all didn't catch. This right here, that's Crown Royal. I have that. Where did I put that? Is it over there? That's that's like the fifty dollar bottle of Crown Royal. But also another thing you didn't notice: these niggas were responsible for why you can't wear <laughs> fitted caps crooked, and you can't wear crazy stuff. You can't where I'm at. You can't wear a white tee in the club. You can't have your hat. It has to be forward. There was people in the early two thousands that ruined it for everybody. They was there in Tim's. You can't wear them there, which is smart because you'll be stepping on people's feet and it hurts really bad if you ever got us to who is i never noticed her in a video when was this 2003 so that's about 10 15 16 years so she could be 20 something in this 30 40 she might still she might can still get the thing cool you know what i'm saying she don't look that old Ah. I think it's love, so come give me a hug. Funk Master Flex. Fame in the making love. So oh my, what the hell are those? Pull up our friends, see the bands on dub. I'm in the club. Even the hoes, they want to fuck. See, zipping in the curtain, like throw the weed up. Watch how I move, and mistake before I play up. Oh my gosh. 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 Oh my gosh.
Make sure you help me out, man. You? So the plan is to put the rap game in a choke. All I'm full of focus, man. My money on my mind. She is. Who is she? My girl and with a nine, they ready to go find me in the club. Bottle full of bug, my mom gives me need to give me give me love. I'm in the habit of six, I ain't in the making love, so come give me a hug. Yeah, find me in the club. Bottle full of bug. I ain't in the making love, so come give me a hug. Give me give me love. My flow, my show, my need the dope. All my fancy things. Mm, they ain't up and I ain't changed. Way more than you hate. Oh, you mad? I thought you'd be happy I made it. Cat, bottle ball, toasting to the good. Like, you that. You're trying to take me out there, right? I, I know the uncensored one so much. If the roof on fire, up, let it burn. Talking about money, homie, I ain't concerned. Uh, uh, him hating, watch the money pile up. We can go upside your head with a bottle of bum. Come on, you know where we be. Find me in the club. This, I shouldn't have even react to it because I'm not even in y'all proper reaction. It's just because I love this song so much because literally, Vince Stables has spoken on and all that. The previous generation before us value Tupac a lot, right? Our generation really values 50 Cent because he he really controlled the narrative and everything. Like he was just he was untouchable. Super swole, got shot, ate all that, had his clothing line, had a video game, did all this like super superstar stuff. The only thing he ain't do is play basketball, and that's probably because he wasn't good at it. But let him that did that. That would have been a 50 cent basketball game. He had everything. So we just valued him so much. Like I was there looking, get all the mixtapes, like every like everything I could find, I wanted 50 cent stuff, man. So it's crazy just to see like that now probably for this generation, and they don't give him that credit. There's a lot of people that don't get a whole bunch of credit. 50 Cent still gets his credit because he's still relevant. Chief Keef didn't get his credit. Lil B didn't get his credit. Soldier Boy had to force this way to get his credit. There's a lot of people that paved the way, man. It's pretty dope. I need to go to a party, man. I'm bored. Me in the club. Bottle full of club. Yeah, you know I man, having sex. I ain't in the making love, so come give me a hug. You try to act like you don't know where to be at. Pop, pop off. Shady Aftermath. He was not in the club, as a matter of fact, by the way. He didn't even barely drink. <laughs> but he got our ass. He tricked us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is that the game? What? The game was in this? Yo. I, I did not know that to this day. I thought that was later. Wow. Wow. That is a smooth cameo. I did not know that whatsoever. Let me not play Coolio Gangsta's Paradise. Because guess what? His team will copyright you. Let it be three seconds. And he copyrights you. Not Coolio, his team. I, I don't know what Coolio's doing. Who's still listening to this in June of 2019? Dang. Uh, they got that ain't even in that ain't even English. They talking about June nineteen. I know that. I see him. That's pretty dope. Um, please TikTok don't take it from us. Oh, they will. He's two thousand nine six firm. He's still in the club. Yeah, man. G Unit has a huge fan base. Uh, who was talking about that? It might have been Roy. Uh, talking about who was the most influential group all around. And it, you can say Rockefeller, but I'm pretty sure it is. It he actually had a valid point. It might be G Unit because worldwide, G Unit was everywhere. Every everything every like like think of how much Fifty Cent really sold. Like he sold millions of albums. Like he could go everywhere. But I think they were talking about like to this day. If you would have put G Unit out there, 
There's a lot of people that would go to a concert, like a G Unit concert. I probably would still go to it. I'd be there. I was just how to stunt. I'd be there happy as hell, man. But eh, it's up for interpretation. How y'all feeling? How how old were you when this song came out? Some of y'all probably weren't even born, but how do you how does this song make you feel, man? Give me that nostalgia feel from it also that you got. If you like this, you want more, let me know in the comment section below. Make sure you subscribe. Till next time, peace.